Edgeware is a software company. Edgeware is an educational software company that makes uh, online test making products for teachers. Yeah. Edgeware is an educational software company for teachers and students. Um, Edgeware is an educational software company that focuses on making teachers' jobs easier. Edgeware is an educational software company. Um, we specialize in making both desktop and online software, which helps teachers um, make their job easier. Our mission here at Edgeware is to help children learn. Um, so when I come into work, whether it's making tests or uh, going out to schools and doing product development, professional development for teachers, I can take pride in the work that I do, knowing that it's positive and impactful and really makes a difference in the world. My coworkers are very enthusiastic people, passionate. Uh, working at Edgeware is pretty awesome. Uh, they're super flexible with hours. Um, they really uh, cater to your classes. They know you're in college. They know school comes first. Uh, it's always a motto we've had around here. So when finals are around, everyone understands if you can't make it in. But when winter break and summer break comes around, there's always hours. Uh, we're a pretty small company and we're constantly trying to innovate and uh, reach a new, broader market. Working here is, is fun and the hours are flexible. Because there's just the really good energy here. There's a, it's a really great environment. Everyone's really excited about coming to work and working on really interesting products. Everyone here really works together as a team and coming into work every day you look forward to the challenges that you're going to face and how you can achieve your goals and be successful. Uh, so it's it's a lot of fun. It's it's like being a part of, of something bigger than you, uh, which I really enjoy. I feel like a lot of jobs I've had before it was all about just meeting the status quo, you know, getting what you need to do and getting out the door and going home. But as you are, we're constantly pushing each other. Everyone's trying to get you to do stuff you're not comfortable with, get you to, to learn new skill sets to add to stuff you already can do. I used to draw comics uh, when I was in college, and uh, I actually came in for an interview and I showed uh, the owner at the time uh, my comic books, and he was really impressed by them and immediately gave me a job as an artist here. And since then, I've been doing everything from uh, web design to game design to uh, software design. I went to one of Stony Brook's job fairs. I got a job at Edgeware uh, while attending the job fair at Stony Brook. I got a job here through one of the job fairs on campus at Stony Brook. Uh, I actually got a job here when I worked in high school. One of my friends who also worked here uh, helped me find the job. So he brought me in, Bill gave me a quick minute interview, and uh, then I had the job. Um, I went to the job fair, and I, um, a few days later, I was contacted by the recruiter, and I was asked to submit a sample code, and then I was invited to the interview, and I got the job. Uh, I have a bachelor's degree in computer science, which I got at Stony Brook. Uh, I started working here while I was undergrad there, uh, and I graduated and continued working here since then. Um, so I went to uh, Stony Brook University, so I have a bachelor's there. I'm currently uh, a master's student at Stony Brook. I graduated from Stony Brook University with a computer science bachelor's degree. Uh, so I'm currently working on an economics degree from Stony Brook. This is my last semester, I'll be graduating in a few months. Currently I'm studying economics at Stony Brook University and I'm considering minoring in sustainability. Uh, the, you know, working here has been great. Uh, before this I worked at, um, I worked at a library. I live in Queens, uh, so I actually was able to buy a car thanks to working at Edgeware and I, uh, I drive that in from the city an hour every day. Um, I live about 10 minutes down the road, uh, and Stony Brook's about 10 minutes down the road in the other direction, so this is, this is actually right, right between the trip I was, uh, I was making every day anyway. My commute is pretty easy. It's about a 20 minute drive. Uh, my hours allow me to avoid the um, rush hour traffic, so that's nice. And Smithtown happens to be right in the middle of my commute. I pass by it every day, so it works out. Edgeware actually falls right between Huntington and Stony Brook, so it's on my way to Stony Brook. I don't really have to go out of my way anywhere. Um, and uh, if you don't have a car, the train station is just about two minutes away from the office itself, so uh, it wouldn't be too bad. I 
I'm currently working on a complete redesign of our test making software. Uh, it lets teachers make tests online and then give them to students online. I'm a web developer and at the being, uh, when I first got here I only know a little thing about web development and during work here I got to learn uh, different uh, types of new frameworks and new technologies. It's been great. There's been uh, a lot of new products that we've seen. We've launched a bunch of new stuff, uh, Clicker School, um, Test Wizard, uh, all were not really launched before I was here. Got to work on the launch of all of those. So I work on video projects, I work on video tutorials, I do anything that involves sound. And I get to work with the programmers here and do some testing of the sites. We also do testing for the website and general tech support, sales, that kind of stuff. I'm the artist at Edgeware, so I'm pretty much responsible for how everything looks and how it feels. Um, so where I fit in is trying to figure out what people want, how they want it to feel, and then making sure that I'm not just doing it myself, but sharing with everybody and finding out what works better, what works, uh, what doesn't work that well. You know, we're encouraged to learn new things all the time here and I've gotten experience with a lot of technologies that I never used before. Uh, but along the way I became very um, affluent in different multimedia software, uh, different computer languages and I've been able to use that here uh, both to bring uh, creative work uh, but also share my understanding of, of computers and technology. Uh, but after I came here there were, there were things with specific programs like Adobe and Microsoft Office where I became a little more fluent with them. It's, it's really inspiring, like I learned so much in just my first few months here than I did, you know, sitting in a class a lot of the time. Uh, my, just, my level of experience just shot up because every day you have to meet deadlines and get stuff done and then everyone around you is always there to help you out, look at your code, look at your work and just help you improve in every way. I've worked on a lot of new frameworks and uh, stuff since I've worked here. Um, I didn't know, before I worked here, I didn't know Django, I didn't know ASP.NET, I didn't know um, uh, Backbone. Uh, I didn't know underscore. Um, just so many things that I've learned, I learned just from working here and from being encouraged to learn new things here. Everybody here has a lot of ideas and everybody pitches in their ideas. The cool thing about Edgeware is you're surrounded by really brilliant people. Uh, at Edgeware, we really like to celebrate birthdays. And everybody has a birthday, so everyone likes to feel special, and we do some fun, crazy things. We brought a pinata into the office for a birthday, so that was a ton of fun. Edgeware to me is a family. Uh, you know, we all work together really close. Uh, we get along. Some of my best friends that I've made are were my coworkers or former coworkers. Uh, so I really feel good about working at this company. Uh, I think it's different here because everyone actually cares about the stuff we're making. Like a good family, you pool your resources, you come together, and uh, you solve the problems. The co-workers I have, I, there's nobody here I don't like, and they're a very helpful uh, bunch of people. Anything, you have a problem with anything, everybody here is willing to help, and uh, we're all willing to share the, the workload here, and uh, it's a very fun environment. People here really want to see the company succeed, and they really want to see our product succeed. So they, they push extra hard, um, and they really push each other to make the product better. They're really talented, brilliant, passionate people. Um, and when you get a group like that together, trying to accomplish something, you know you're going to be successful. Edgeware was actually founded in the 90s, um, but it has kind of been reborn for the cloud era. And it feels like a startup now because it's you know, young college-age students working together with tech and education uh, and trying to build an amazing product. You know? One, the cool thing about Edgeware is it's not content in its ways, it's always trying to innovate, it's always trying to look for the next big thing in education. I see Edgeware continuing to innovate and reach uh, more schools throughout the country. Because we're a super small team, uh, we're super agile in that we're not afraid to iterate, we're not afraid to start over, we're not afraid to question our decisions. I think that there's a lot of opportunity for us to grow on the web uh, and expand beyond just you know like the New York metropolitan area. So the rest of the country and the rest of the world uh, are all looking for educational technology. And I think 
there's it's a great market that we can take advantage of. At this point, that we are redeploying our software, which at one point was made for the desktop platform. Uh, but just as the markets have changed and most software has moved online, we're finding that moving online is like creating a brand new piece of software. You get hands-on experience in uh, being responsible for something really big. You're not just working on a small part of a product or the really small part of a software. Instead, you're, you're really making big decisions and, uh, and making a big change in, in how it's going to look in the end. Well, they've made some huge advancements with online uh, softwares, and uh, the way I see it, it there, there's still some perfection to, to be done with the products themselves, but once we can get that, I can see Edgeware becoming a leading force in the market. We're always staying on the cusp of the new thing that's coming out, and we're not just uh, content in what we have already.